YouTube's only approved, sanctified, copyright free cock excelente. I have positioned us, oh no, through. <laughs> through this absolute minefield of a strip club so we can come back and tell Vivi that poor little Julius, oh dear, has been thoroughly slain. Look who's back. Hello, it's me. Couldn't stay away, could you? Well, no, because I assume you've got a quest reward for me about Hatter. Mm -hmm. He has a 60-foot dancing werewolf in his garden. Oh, I suppose I should just tear it up. But I just, I can't. I can't rip up the product of that man's soul. Here, would you tear it up for me? Oh, what are you... Sorry, what were we talking about? I blanked out there. Oh, the screenplay, of course. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I found out the name of his source. Are they... I mean, did you? Yes, poor Julius is dead and splattered. Many of you said that if we weren't... Uh, if we weren't such low humanity, we could have... Um, we, we could have basically saved him, you know, we could have asked him to get out of town, but because we're so low humanity, we just didn't even have the option in the first place. So, it, we might need another dance segment for Cock Excelente, get him to go dance on a dance floor for another five minutes and build back up his, uh, his mighty, mighty vampire strength. Just because I feel like, you know, we've, we've been, we've been great for the Camarilla, but not so great for Toreador. Uh, you know, we, we haven't been a very, a very human vampire, have we? It's taken care of. It must have been difficult. But take some comfort in knowing if you hadn't, someone else would have had to. Well, not you, I don't evidently. I appreciate your help. A lot. Oh, Masquerade Redemption. How much do you appreciate it? Yeah, it's not a lot. But it should be enough to buy yourself something a bit more appropriate for a personal acquaintance of Velvet Valor. Oh, thank you. See you around, Vivi. Has she got anything else for us? Three, four hundred gold. Look who's back. Hello. My friends call me Vivi. Velvet will do. You said we were friends. Well, actually, you said uh, you said we were acquaintances, mm -hmm. I guess. Right, so has she got anything else? Tell me about yourself. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, you know what? We've already asked her all of this stuff, haven't we? I think we're probably done with... With... Oh, God. Oh, God. With Velvet Valor and her mighty club of channel strikes. <laughs> so, I think that means that we now have a grand total of a single mission on our mission list. Besides, of course, the main quest and um, my pish fetish. Uh, what have we got here? Isaac is demanding tribute before you will have search for the Nosferatu. Of course, we have to go to the internet cafe and hack a PC. Uh, I couldn't think of anything more appropriate for a man of our skills than typing in a password into a computer. Cock excellente. So, oh, along with that, of course, we do have, um, ah, oh, the graffiti's back to being... Hello? What are you... What are you doing down here? This is quite literally just a... D what? You dirty, dirty man. What were you doing down there? Um, what was I about to talk about? Sorry, the music cutting out really, really put me off there. Right, of course, we've got the graveyard to do at some stage as well. Um, so I was told, apparently, if we... Um, if we ignore his, his request for us to shoot zombies, he gives us another quest instead. Now, I'm not saying I don't want to do the quest where we shoot the zombies, but it's a bit boring for an episode. Um, so I can do it and just edit it out or speed it up or something like that. Um, it's down to you guys, really. We'll worry about that when we are exhausted of the quest. So the one place we haven't gone, the one place everybody wants me to go, is the red spot. The moon is out. Oh. In oh, I thought it was you talking then. Okay. Well, here we are. Nobody no way. Is that our cousin? Chode Excelente? What the hell are you doing here? And hey, what if he's here to visit... One. 62 Oh 63 Oh no 15 more cents and you're going in my stomach Jocko Bob I thought that was Chode Excelente but quite clearly that's uh, sp sp Spicoli Insects Okay Um silly me so I must be getting them confused Sorry it's the hair you know we have a very familial hair Oh what is that a money clip Hello $25 just in a in a in a fridge huh We've got all my favorite brands like car polish and car wax and 
more car wax. Oh, God, what is this horrible meat carousel? There's only one meat carousel in this city, my friend, and his name is Cog Excellente. I don't like that man. He's a bit strange. Zinc? Chops off. This is a real interesting look into an American... Are, are those things real? Do you genuinely get like these horrible sausage carousels? That's vile. What else you got in here? We've got some plastic spoons. Those are always good to have. Uh, excuse me. Sorry, friend. What does that say? Coot. Oh, Kulo. <laughs> okay. I'm sick of listening to that man speak. Oh. Uh, uh. Welcome to Red Spot, home Let's of the Monstro Chug. 72 ounces of your favorite you beverage for 89 cents. Is that good? Blah, blah. Okay. You need help or something? I don't know what 72 ounces is, and I don't know what 89 cents are, but I'll trust you. Uh, what's going on around here? Anything exciting or unusual? Always. You should come out and see my band, a bowl of cereal. We're playing oh, no tomorrow way. night. Crematorium. Five bucks, two drink men. We're going to ruin the place. Ebola cereal? Not a... Whoa. Anything else I should know? Yeah. The Vesuvius rocks. They don't let me in anymore, but damn, the girls in there, dude. <laughs> smuggling ring. Uh, thanks. I'll go check it out. Uh, hey, you know, you should really ask me about the special, you know? Uh, all right. What's the special? I'm glad you asked that, bro. Seeing as how you look trustworthy, we already know this guy sells guns because the guy in the um uh the 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 titty bar, what's his name? You know the creepy guy with the ponytail. You interested? Of course. Show me what you've got. He told us that. Oh, that looks good. That looks like an appropriate gun for uh a sledgehammer, a weapon to surpass Fat Larry's fire axe. Wow. Um, what is this? Light leather. Light leather has an arm rating of two, but hinders movement slightly, resulting in a minus one to dexterity. Some examples of light leather clothing are leather jackets, leather skirts, leather... Okay, I know what leather clothing is. Thank you, game. Um, so, lower dexterity. Dexterity is melee combat, correct? So we don't really need to worry about that. Um, armor rating of two, so we can soak up more shots. That for Coque Excelente seems a bit more appropriate. Um, let's just go to our character page. What is that like? Somewhere over here. Here we are. Um, what does dexterity affect? Hit harder, move faster, and soak damage. Um, I don't really care about that too much. And of course, clothes we can always change on the situation anyway, right? We can just we can just F3 it and swap out. Okay, well that's not a problem then. Um, yeah, we'll have that. I'll buy those, sure. There's no reason not to buy it. It's not like it replaces our current one, right? I like this weapon. That looks fun. Alternate fire mode fan. What the hell is that? Okay. Um, I'll take it. What else you got here? Sledgehammer? I'll take it. Why not? We've got enough dollars for it. Um, and I'm going to spend every last penny on ammo for that gun. Because that seems quite fun. What have we got in the gentleman's room? Please, keep, stop, sink. Keep, keep, stop, sink? What? Oh, like, like, a, it's, it's, what do you, what do you call it in America? Like a, like a car stop or something, I would assume. At all times, thank you. Do not drop trash here. What have we got in the ladies? Um, the same thing. Doggies? Dead bird? <laughs> ah, they've got the new copy of Chin. My favorite. Okay, well, let's actually go and go and investigate the electronics. Uh, the electronics store? No, the, the cyber cafe. I want to see that new gun that we got as well. Where is that? Oh, look at this, though. Oh, man. I, a weapon that truly suits, I think. Cock Excellentia as well. I will admit the jacket isn't very cock. Um, but the, the, the hammer. The hammer is on brand. And what have we got? We've got a crappy revolver. Friendship ended with you. Oh, look at that. Look at the texture on that fucking gun compared to, uh, I don't know, literally anything else in this game. Wow. Let's probably put that away. Gives the wrong impression. Okay. And then I feel like we need to go dancing in our big heavy leather jacket at some point. Hello. Uh, no. Oh, they've got Extreme Hoop and Stick 3. Holy shit. Hello. How's it going? Everybody, go okay, your let's way. have a look around first. We've got plenty of plenty of PCs. AWP Hawk, don't know what that means. Space Tennis Online. Oh, look at all these, though. <laughs> need to read racing. That's quite good. <laughs> Collide? That almost looks like it could be a real game. Or like a real band or something. Because they've, they've, that quite clearly has... Far more effort put into it than need to read. No offense, need to read. We've got Dong? What the hell are Dong and that man doing in the bathroom? 
Uh, very confusing. Park Ranger. Bella Mort. Okay, Die My Darling. No, known for the, uh, what is it called? Ebola cereal. Right, okay. Let's go hack a PC then. So who's it? whose PC are we hacking? Um, computer with the directory Joseph K and the password Kafka. Okay. Joseph K. Kafka. Um... Ground Zero Logon UQTU. Hacker man. I'm in. Password required. Get in there. Quit Purbusker. Unsurprisingly, it's not that one. Um, let's see if we can up our hacking skill then. See if we can actually get in some of these. This seems quite important. Joseph K. Tupacula. Okay. Um, I'm going to assume we can't hack that one either. Whoops. My bad. No off button on these PCs. You have to, to manually shut them all down. Noob Camper. Joseph, Joseph K. Joseph K. Joseph K. Uh, email was Kafka. There we are. No subject. Him in the alley behind Fast Buck. Okay. And then next, and this just takes a virus in this attachment. Quarantine and sent notes. Of, so we've seen that a couple of times, haven't we? The, the, the virus. I wonder if that alludes to anything else. Apps. Um, available on directory. Access denied. Oh, he hasn't got enough money to play his games. Poor guy. Okay. Uh, let's go home and then quit. Talk about fucking microtransactions, huh? Donk! Fucking get out of here. Right, okay. Uh, Hollywood Celebrity Database, begin your search. A to F. Um, got Alfredo Alonso, a more sappy blingo, Captain Bananas. Okay. Obviously, I'm not going to read through all of these because we'll be here forever. Uh, but if you've got any if you've got any requests for celebrities you want me to look at, Nivbed. We've heard about Nivbed. That's the one on the all the... If you want to spot this artist, try West Hollywood, but approach with caution. He's easily provoked in dangerous levels of sass. Nivbed was written on all the letterboxes, right? Hmm. That's interesting. Um, let's go SZ. Tawny, Ginger, and Margaret Tang. Are they, um... Frankie, Sammy? Tawny Sessions, Ginger Swan, Margaret Tang. I was going to say, maybe they're game developers. Um, but those names all sound made up. Somehow they've managed to come up with a list of the most made up people. Maybe that's what they based the studio developers on, huh? We only hire from... <laughs> we only hire you if you've got a made up sounding name. Right, I want to see if we can um, put any more points in hacking or something like that. Um... Out of pure curiosity, does wearing this jacket actively lower our lockpick and sneak? I assume it would, right? Um, so what do we want then? Hacking, hacking, hacking. Either wits, which gives hacking and defense, or computer that gives just straight up hacking. Is there any reason not to go into wits at this point? If we're just specifically after hacking, that's only going to cost us four, whereas this one's obviously going to cost us nine. So I think we'll put one into... One into that. Takes up to five hacking. Um, we should read those books as well, actually, because I, I did say that we've got some books to read, and I completely forgot to read them, so, um, read. There we are. Excellent. And then security skill as well. Excellent, excellent, very good. Wow, our character is getting pro quite, quite good at this point, huh? We could go into, like, more firearms, because we're, we're still pretty crap when it comes to, when it comes to fighting. Um, what is subterfuge? It's the motive to deceive others. Oh, it's seduction. Oh, that's something I've actually quite ignored this entire game, though, huh? Wow, that's something I've, I've quite heavily ignored th th this game. Crazy, okay. Um, what about, like, persuasion? Charisma? I feel like charisma for Cock Excelente should be a little bit higher. The fact that we're playing Toreador and only have three three charisma is, is pretty pretty crap, I think. Um, I'm alright with that. And then we've got seven experience left over, so if you guys have any, uh, have any recommendations or suggestions, I'll save some to not completely brick our character. Let's see if we can hack now. And hack a man. Ah, oh, there we go. Shizzle. Nice work. Okay. Dude, my Prussians totally rushed your Franks last night in Eurocraft. Playing tonight. Also, that girl that sits next to me in science talks to me today. She totally wants me to do her. Thank you. <laughs> Read your mum. No dude at your mum. Thank you for that. Next, your mum. Psych, your mum. What are you doing to me, Tupacula? I say cover me, not die like a little bitch. One more food bar and you're out of the clan. Classic. Sephiroth at sol.btm. That's quite good. I straight snatched the new Troika game. If you hack all the code, you can unlock Count Chocula. Oh, my favorite. Wow. I knew all of that stuff because I am a professional gamer after all. Um, have we got somewhere else to hack? It's that one. Oh, it's this one over here. Right, here we go. Email. 
uh, and Ackerman. Subarashi. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Hitomi, hello. Hello, I am Ayako. Let's English practice. Your homestay, how is it? America must be the coolest. You're in Hollywood. Are you in a movie? Love, Ayako. Japanese pen pal. Present, pre pre present, Genta and I ate o Okonomiyaki of Yokohama. That ex extremeness was tasty. What is eaten in America? Does they eat the Japanese food? I must investigate. Our Americans have long legs. Are your date American boy? Is the image sent? Is it happy? This weekend I go to the hot spring where my family have been attached. I am excited very. When we are the child, is Yuki which the friend to us is remembered? She is also inquiring about the thing in America. Is the pleasant time past? Send many images due to me. Ayako. Wow. What a staggeringly frightening look into the lives of people on the internet. And I'm talking about real life as well as <laughs> as well as these fake characters in game. There's so many PCs actually, isn't there? Um, so this one is is just the celebrity database. This is the one we've already hacked, right? What have we got through here? Employees only. I'll have to see about that, my friend. Um, the door requires a code. Okay. So it looks like more might be taking place here than what we've been let on to. Uh, can't do anything with the PC by the looks of it. Oh! Dong's on the camera. Fucking Dong. What are you doing? Is he waiting for us? Is Dong gonna jump us? What the hell? Threw that chair at him and now he's just fucking pissed. Uh, you can money? That's really what I came in here for, I'll be honest, to look for some money to steal. Still haven't been to Megahertz Computing, by the way. Never, not gonna let that die until we've gone there quickly. Let's distract him. Go, 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 go. Right, okay. We've gotta go to an alley behind Burger Shot, or whatever the hell it was called. I think Burger Shot might be from Grand Theft Auto, right? Fast Buck. Fast Buck. Which one was... Fucking try and follow me. Dong. Excelente. Right, where, sorry, where are we going? Fast buck. Cash is checked. Excellent. Uh, okay, so behind fast buck. Should I get a gun ready or, or what? Hello? Yeah? What do you want? Uh, you the guy with the tape? Isaac sent me. Yeah? I mean, what? Who the hell is Isaac? I don't know anyone named Isaac. Get lost, pal. Come on, you know about the tape? Just give it to me and you can go. Tape? What tape? I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Oh, I've got a slash on with your name on it, brother. Uh, fine, I'll tell Isaac you wouldn't give me what's his. Right. Let's be a bit more Sorry. frightening. It's We've got just a sledgehammer, for God's sake. I mean, something is... I just want out of this whole thing. I don't want anything to do with that damn tape. Why? What's going on? I, I you watch know. it in seven days. I mean, a when it comes to spooky video, vampire crawls everything. out of your TV. And I do mean Hits you with a sledgehammer. This thing, it's sick. It can't be real, but it is. Oh, is it like I a tape it. of? It's real and it scares the vampires hell out of me. or something. Uh, to be such a coward, it's only a tape. How bad could oh, it be? You have no idea. It's disgusting. That girl, the things that are happening. Oh, to it's her. two girls, one car. It just ain't right, Got man. it. It just ain't right. No, something's wrong. Something's after me. I swear to God, something's after me. Maybe it actually is the ring. <laughs> a girl, something's happening to her, ain't right, something's after me. Uh, what What are you talking about? Every place I go, wherever I Oh, it look, actually I is the ring. I said that as a joke, but shadows. no. It's... My phone rings, I hear something breathing on the other end, and... Shit. I'm out, man. I'm out of this whole thing. All right, all right, just give me the tape. I don't have it. I stashed it someplace. Look, you need to find Ginger Swans. Ginger Swans? Huh? Oh, on the, the, the celebrity that? database. Oh, shit. Did you see that? I remember Ginger Swan. I'm getting the fuck out of here. See what? Oh! He's fucking gone. What the? Oh! oh. Christ! <gasps> Something just dragged him into the... Into the sewers, right? Should we go in after him or what? A <laughs> fucking baby. We've not actually been in the sewers in. Oh no. All right. We already have this weapon. A severed arm. Hello. My my man. I feel like we should probably pop all specs or something. Okay. 
Uh, so some somebody has seen is it like a like a Nosferatu, like a video of a a vampire or something. Yeah, that leads back out. All right, see so what we can find. I'm using all specs just in case. I don't know. Maybe there is an invisible enemy. I'm on something. Um, more importantly, so it's a little bit hopefully easier for you guys to see on the video. We go over here. Was oh, that blood? No, it's just a texture. Um, leads back out. Where does this one go to? Uh, this one goes up. Okay. And all space is essentially free in sewers as well, right? Because there's rats everywhere and it's only one blood point. So, ah, a metal door. Oh, we're in a sewer. Well, the last experience we have in a metal door in a sewer. I.e. me wandering around for 40 minutes looking in the wrong bloody sewer. Let's look down here. I thought that mouse had, like, full-blown human arms then. Right, okay. Let's go and have a look at the metal door of our hopes and dreams. And down here, I assume this is just another access point. Uh, yes it is. There's only one place our good friend could have gone to. Hmm. Gotta keep keep watching your sides. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> All right, let me in. Oh, well, or not then? Never mind. Guess we'll leave. So something something killed him and brought him down here. That's all we know. Oh, hello. Don't mind me. <laughs> Crazy man pops out of the sewers with a gun and a leather jacket. All right, let's put that away. Okay, so what the hell do we do now? We go, we go back and we look up Ginger Swan. See, I, I, I have a feeling that the tape we've got in our backpack that we pulled out of that thing opposite Mercurio, um, to put out that chest, I don't think so. is the is the tape. Excuse me. Right there we are. Um, G to M, um, or is it Swan Ginger? So S to Z, um, Swan Ginger. Swan, a name synonymously with beauty and glamour, to this day was a great celebrity of late 40s and early 50s. Her credits include movies such as Gilded Hummingbird and When No Means Yes. After the passing in 1964, she was interred in the Hollywood Forever Cemetery Mausoleum. Oh, oh dear, this is very different to what I expected. Okay, um... Ah! Don't fucking flex on me, Don. Don't fucking flex on me. Yeah, you drink your damn beer. God, he was always such a loser. Kim Dong. Never did anything with his life. It was antagonized. Cock excelente. Follow him wherever he went. Pretend to sit in chairs around him. Unbelievable man. Um, can't go in there. Thought it might be worth having a look. So we gotta go to the mausoleum. Yeah, okay. Get ready for some spooks then. I wanna go in here. Uh, whoop. Uh, whoop. I've got to be careful where I throw... Whoop. Got to be careful where I throw these. Because last time I picked one of these up, it bounced off the floor and killed a homeless person. So, I'm going to safely place them elsewhere. And in we go. The mausoleum of Ginger Swan. So, a mausoleum could be any of these, these ones here, I assume. Um, I don't know if they mean, like, the mausoleum. Like, the big... You know, like the big mausoleum. Uh, got Chad. Meryl. Uh. What have we got there? Nothing. Alright, we've got Andrew Meggs. Another Andrew Meggs. It's a bit weird. Meryl, popular name. Well, this weird thing. What the hell this is for? Okay, we've got big old. Big old sarcophagus there. Just want to make sure we're not missing anything. Uh, but you? No, you're locked. What have we got there? Nothing. We've got gateway to the void itself. That's always hand handy to have in a cemetery. Just in case of, you know, just in case someone refuses to die. I guess it must mean, like, the mausoleum. Like, the, mo this mausoleum. Meryl again. Okay. Well, let's go and have a look then, I guess. See what we can find. Those of a easily spooked disposition may want to look away now. Alright. Here we go. 
Rock Excellente. Give me my fucking sledgehammer. Brace yourself. We're coming in. Ooh. Um, horse face. That'll do it. Hello? Hello? Okay, there's bones on the floor there. This little secret looking door. Ah, here we go. Horror tape. Excellent. Was that all there was to it? Oops. Uh, okay. We might as well have a look around the rest of the mausoleum while we're here. Um, something down this side, perhaps. Nothing. Stained glass windows. They're quite nice. A lot of effort into this spooky mausoleum. All right, we've got the horror tape. I guess we, uh, I guess that's all there was to it. I was expecting something spooky, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> oh, well, that was a little anticlimactic. Got my sledgehammer out for nothing. I'm going to keep it just in case if you know. Zombies, werewolves, vampires, uh, mummies. It might be mummies. Poor Ashton. Went before his time. So if you speak to the guy in there, um, he's the one that gives us the quest to shoot the zombies in this graveyard. You have to stop the zombies getting out of that gate over there, the, the gate that leads to the void. And this gate at the top here, but they can spawn in everywhere. Um, so I, it's, it's literally just a case of running back and forth and back and forth. It seems pretty dull. And you lose Masquerade as well if you um, if you fail the quest. So to be honest, I think I'll just do that one some other point in the future. Well, let's put that away for a start. I guess we go back to Isaac now. Made friends with the Prince. Or the, the Baron. Or the whatever he decides to call himself. Go on, taxi driver, drive! Oh, damn it. It's across the road now. It's alright. Don't worry about it. You're okay. Ha! <laughs> I don't know if you saw that. She did just randomly walk up to that door, kick it, and walk away. That's quite good. Okay, I appreciate that. All the characters in this game have got a bit weird. They've all got a bit strange, haven't they? It's not down that one, is it? It's down this one. Oh, hello. Bollocks. Oh, come on. I thought I could... All right, my bad. I thought I could just grab him. I thought we were down an alley. I thought we could just grab him and be done with it. But no. No. Doesn't matter, right? Criminal violations don't don't mean anything as long as we hide. Hello. You made good time. Hand me the item. I want to watch it first. Here. I didn't doubt you'd find this. And I apologize if I was overly imperious before. A reflex action. I get a lot of young blood. I like this guy. Getting their place. He's he's I'll down to earth. He's, he's a sensible fellow. But first. But first. This tape. Oh, I'm oh we actually have to watch it. Hype, so oh, no. Get, get ready to be spooked. I do have a feeling that whatever's here may be of use to both of us. Ah, what are those? <laughs> what the fuck are those? <laughs> oh. I've got like a dirty baboon on this. Death Mask Productions. Thank you, Death Mask. Um, it's more disturbing than I was led to believe. That was disturbing. You I've, I've got a question. Who's the cameraman? Can't you? Fun stuff. Why is this important to it me? It just so happens that around the time this snuff film started circulating, the Nosferatu disappeared. I tried to elicit their help in tracking down the source. Oh. For the first time in all these years, I was dismayed by their absence. Okay. I think it's have something to do with their disappearance. I assume it does. It's awfully coincidental otherwise. And those creatures. I don't know how many professional FX houses could pull those off. There's a problem, though, in that the film's incomplete. The first half is damaged. Oh, no. We need a complete copy. Uh... Where do I get a better copy? Behind You're jerking me around all night. the Hollywood of Dream Factory. There's another city churning out a vile byproduct for the furtive consumption of a debauched audience. I have no doubt the film's found its way to another... I know exactly who would sell this type of thing, my friend. Oh, I know exactly who would sell this type of thing. We're, we're, old, we're old pals. We're not old pals. I clubbed one of his... <coughs> one of his dancers to death. I think the police have fucked off. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they just don't care, do they? I like the fact that he pulled a gun and then ran off and hid in the street about two foot away from where we actually tried to eat him, but that's okay. It's gotta be... 
It's got to be Filth Central over here, hasn't it? I can't remember the name of it now. I see you over there. I see you over there. Uh, this guy. This this guy here. He's got to know something. Alternatively, we could go and have a word with the Nosferatu back in Santa Monica, right? Hello. What can I do for you, Slick? Uh, I've got a few questions for yeah. you. Yeah? What do you want to know? I want to know where I can get a movie. Of someone being murdered horribly. Those guys? Yeah. Yeah, I heard of them. Oh, what a shocker. Why do you want to know? Ah, uh, I might be in the market for some of their products. Really? You a cop? Uh, do I look like five hours for you and trying to get some information? All right. Listen, I'll tell you a little bit, but if anyone comes asking, you never heard it from me. They produce only the most hardcore video. I'm not even talking black market here, more like black hole market. Not the kind of product you huh. want to get mixed up in. Um, great. What kind of stuff? The kind of stuff that gets you put in jail for just talking about it, all right? Snuff Films is just the tip of the iceberg. Oh. I only seen one of their videos, and I swear I couldn't eat for a week. Oh, I don't believe you. This, this guy's the, the lady doth protest too much, I think. Real enough that every cop in five states has been trying to track these guys down. They are bad news, pal. You want some advice from me? Stop thinking whatever you're thinking and get your ass back to Kansas. I'm not from Kansas, Flynn. Uh, I got this crazy tape and I need to find out if it's real. A tape? You mean the tape? You've got a copy of it? Have you seen it? Uh, maybe. Look, man, get the hell out of here, all right? I don't want any part of that scene. I hear people seeing that tape ain't been coming home for dinner. I don't deal in that yeah. kind of stuff anymore. You think I should just, just put it on? Just take it somewhere else. Just like leave it on. Uh, look, Flynn, I need to find them. Forget it, man. I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. Huh? What? Who are they? Seriously, get the hell Come out of on. here. Come on. Look, I'm a collector. You can tell me what you know. Okay. Is that all look, it took? <laughs> all I know is that a guy calls on the payphone down the street every once in a while. He'll say something like, the moon is a terrible mistress or sanguine, like my brother. Like and then what? And then all you have to say is, who walks the night with demons of dread? This guy's like no way more than he knows. Supposedly, be told where to meet the guy to pick up product. I don't know for sure. I, uh, I never tried it. You're a liar. I'm scared the shit. You're a goddamn liar. Uh, thanks for the info. Don't walk home alone tonight. Hey, wait. Look, you might as well know this. Word on the street is that they didn't even make the video. They're just distributing it. No one even knows where it comes from. I'm telling you, man. Whatever you're in, get out of it now. I wish I could, Flynn. But I'm in for good. See you later. Oh. Oh. What dark path are we walking, Cock Excellente? This is, this is very un-excellente. Oh. Oh, the game's woken up. There we are. So now we have to call on a payphone. A man... At the end of the street, what do you say? At the end of the street, God knows where that is. Um, we c we call a man, and we tell him something, 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 and they say something, something, something. By the way, here's your smut film. Uh, I shouldn't say smut film. I should say snuff film, or worse, expelled. And then that's it. We're in. Oh God, this is very much not excellente. God oh, damn it, Tom was right. The end of the street. What that? Which street are you talking about? Maybe Dong's in on it, you know? With a name like Dong Excelente, he would, uh... They'd, they'd immediately be on board. Payphone. Ah, here we go. Uh... uh hello? <laughs> hello? Not that one, evidently. It's a payphone at the end of the street, isn't it? I walk from one end of the street to the other and I can't see any... Dinner? Hello. Oh, me too. Um. Yeah, wow, bizarre, huh? I think we can go in there at some point, because look, there's quite clearly a, a room on the other side of that door. Uh. Right. I have, I have really no idea where he wants us to go or who he wants us to speak to, but, um. I will see if we can track it down. The mystery of the payphone continues.